Away from security issues, government has turned down the request of the Conference of Heads of Assisted Senior High Schools, CHAS, for a review of the Free Senior High School policy to allow PTAs play a more active role in the development and administration of schools. Speaking at a conference in Cape Coast, President of CHAS, Yakub Abubakar, said, since the inception of the Free Senior High School program, PTAs and schools across the country have collapsed, accounting for many abundant projects. But speaking on Joy News Prime, Deputy Education Minister Dr. Yawe Duchum said the request will not be granted. Here's why. In education, there's something that is called a structured democratic voice. Mm. If you want to look at how schools perform and get quality outcomes, we want participation by parents, by civic society. Such participation may be called tangential or infused. Tangential is where parents had the opportunity to speak to education policy and to tell policy makers that this is how we want your schools to, um, our schools to run. Mm. And when it's infused, it's where parents participate in decision making at the various schools and contribute so that they will be improved outcomes. So I agree with Charles when they talk about parent participation. Yeah. But in this country for too long, Parent participation has been equated with parent levy. Parent participation goes beyond financial contribution. Yes. And some people may contribute more than what you are going to levy. But, so, so let me but, tell you this. But no, that, let me, that will let be me. an individual decision. No, no, it's uh, not, uh, yes. What they want is for the schools but what they want, as a body and, and as a matter of policy to be given the opportunity to say, if we have a project, the PTA can go ahead and levy every parent to pay a specific amount of money okay. towards the project. So, so understand free senior high school. Ghana is not the first country to do free senior high school. Mm -hmm. What you need to do is a fundraising. Allow parents to contribute whatever amount. And some people may contribute more than what you are going to levy. But, but the idea, that's... no, my brother, my brother, mm -hmm. the idea, if I can explain a bit, it will help your audience. The idea. That school is free. But if you haven't paid your levy, you may not go to the dining hall. Let me tell you, these are real issues. Mm -hmm. Parents, students from poor backgrounds have been prevented from going to dining halls because they have not paid their levies. Mm -hmm. So that kid that comes from a poor background from Bonko Koimbo Sunche District will be told that, yes, you are an achimota. Every student is supposed to pay 500 you could not afford it, and therefore you can't go to a dining hall. And you're talking about how can that be under the free senior high school regime? What that the Ghana Education Service is saying is simple. Parents can contribute to their schools, but it cannot be another fee to block the less fortunate from going to school. And so Charles will not get what he wants, what no. he's asking for. And the free senior high school, the president has already made commitment to school building infrastructure. He is also sending development levy grants to schools Government is not going to impose fees on students when it's supposed to be free. However, there were two other if, you are, if you are a creative headmaster, mm. and some headmasters have done a fantastic job, they have parents contributing, they are recognizing the parents who are contributing, mm. and some will tell you that they are getting more money than when they were levying a flat rate to all parents, because some parents can do 2000